Yo, what's good people? Welcome back to the Name is Cartel YouTube channel. We've got another episode of Off the First Listen for you. Special one today. Uh, well, this came in the post, what, a couple days ago, Thursday. But it is Koji debut album time. A reason to smile. That's what's in here. Came from Bangkok Records. Thank you to them. Um, thank you to Koji Radical for dropping, from what I've heard, a very, very banging album. Apparently, it's already a classic. We're going to get into that. We're going to see what it's saying. Um, yeah, back again. Do you know what? I'm not even going to take too long with this one. Um, obviously, if you watched the first episode, shout out to Lil Sims. Um, sometimes I might be introvert. Uh, yeah, that that video was a bit, mm, you know what I'm saying, but like, you know, we move in it, you know what I'm saying, I don't feel like I did her justice there, but we move in it. Um, I'm going to be playing you guys some of the, some of that, well, yeah, I'm going to play you some, I'm going to play you some of the album, and yeah, we'll see what YouTube algorithms are saying in it, like, we're just going to run with it, because, bro, like, I don't know, like, someone maybe can put in the comments or something and let me know how people are getting away with playing, like, I don't know, like 30 seconds plus of people's tracks and no issue in it. So we'll see in it. But let's get straight into this. Um, right, this is serious packaging here still. But yeah, unboxing of Koji's debut album. Shout out to Koji Radical. Came out on Friday. Uh, I'm not sure when this video is going to come out. But um, oh, right. I'm not sure when this video is going to come out, but it should come out in the next couple of days. Like, you know, close to the release date of the album. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna open this two seconds. Rah. Should have done this before. This should be the album because obviously, you're like, what else is that order? <laughs> but yeah, aha, look at that. that way. Mad Ting Koji Radical Reason to Smile. Debut album, I'm sure debut studio album because obviously if you know about Koji, you know about Kashmir Tears, that album there, or project or EP, whatever you want to call it, that was a banger in it. Actually, do you know I have some merch? Do you know? Don't worry, I have some merch from from when that album or project came out. That project there, certified still, completely certified. <laughs> We're gonna have to get straight into this because like you know I still haven't heard this yet. Um, I wanted to do the unboxing and first time listen, obviously off the first listen properly with the vinyl. I'm going to put on the vinyl player and see what it's saying. But yeah, let's let's open this up. And what comes in here? Oh, do you know, it's not a gatefold. It's like a sleeve, like, you know, the gatefold. Little Sims almost like, you know, opens up like a booklet. That's what a gatefold is. In case people don't know what terminology I'm using there. But um, yeah, this is just a sleeve, pull out sleeve. And yeah, oh, look at that. Man's dripping. In holy water, I would assume. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, you've got the two LP there. Side A and B. All right, cool. So you already know what we do here. Check out what's inside. So let's go back to the gatefolds. I mean, not the gatefold, the sleeve. See what else is in, nothing else in there. But yeah, so you've got the front, front cover. Then you've got the back cover. An album by Koji Radical. Obviously, it's got the track list here. There is about how many songs on here? 15 songs, 15 track album. I, you know what? I can't wait to get into this. So let me just quickly run through the, the track list. And, oh, okay, so on the back of this picture, you have credits and all that stuff. So I guess when you grab your vinyl, take a look at that, see what that's saying. But yeah, so on the first side, uh, side A, you've got Reason to Smile featuring Tiana Major 9, Rotted. Okay, this is about to be lit. Ah, it's about to be lit. Ah, listen, I can't even wait now. It's actually mad still. All right. Um, track two, Together, track three, Nappy, and then uh, track four, Silk featuring Masego. That's a um, recently released single. That's, yeah, that's a vibe as well. Ah, listen, I already know. I already know it's about to be lit. It's about to be lit. That's side A. Then on side B, you have Pressure featuring Shea Universe. Shout out Shea Universe. So, yeah, I've seen her in, um, I've seen her live a couple times still. 
um, was it Camden Assembly? Yeah, a few different places still. One of my guys actually, yeah, do you know? Yeah, <laughs> I'll leave that alone. Um, actually, no, let me say it because that probably sounded bad. One of my guys uh, used to drum for her, so yeah. Shout out, man, like Alex, Alex Dixon, he did this thing. B1 Pressure featuring um, Shea Universe, B2 Born featuring featuring Cash, B3 Pusher Man, uh, yeah, Pusher Man uh, semicolon, no, colon BWI. Not sure what that is, but say none. So that's side B. Side C. So this is this will be track eight. Um, talking featuring is that Khalees? Wait, which Khalees? Khalees, Khalees. Ra. Okay, say nothing. So track eight, talking featuring Khalees and Tiana Major Nan. I don't know if that's the Khalees, like you know, um, milkshake brings all the boys to the yard and that, but we'll see. Um, track nine, War Outside featuring um, Lexa Moore. There's a war going on outside. You already know. <laughs> and then um, you've got Payback. That's the next track featuring Nux. Shout out Nux. That's on Saturday as well. You already know. That's that's one of the singles that came out with this album or came out before the album. And then you've got um, the last track on side C, which is Fubu. Then flip that over. Um... D1, or yeah, first track on side D is Beautiful featuring Shaka and Wretch Free 2. Bro, this album's... Ah, uh, yeah, I can't wait. All right, say nothing. And then you've got the next track, Anywhere featuring... Um, oh, shit. Fe wait, that says Ego and I'm assuming... So Ego and LMA. And then the next track after that, you've got Solo featuring Rex Life Raj. I don't, I don't know who that is, but we'll see. And then the last track on the album is Gangsta. So yeah, that's what you got on each each disc, each LP. Um, yeah, let's take this out and see. Is it up? Oh, yep. Yeah. It's just normal black black vinyl. But yeah, it looks yeah, it looks 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 legit. Looks clean. Obviously, um, this I believe yeah, this is Koji's first um vinyl or first project released on vinyl so this is a momentous occasion and we should get straight into it to be honest see what the see what the music is saying hang on so yeah black vinyl nothing too spectacular with the black vinyls but it is what it is Another thing to mention about this album is the rollout the rollout for this album or for the singles um that came out before the album has been nothing short of amazing and creative to be honest like very like you can just see that a lot of time effort and money has been put into the promotion and and getting this this project to the peoples and to the fans and all that sort of stuff um even like you know the fact that it's on vinyl it's the first project on vinyl for for koji he um he actually well yeah i ordered these from um banquet records and when you ordered them if uh, people that ordered it, they know. But when you ordered them, you got uh, a, the pre-order. When you pre-order them, you get tickets for a Prism show. I'm assuming the thing is, I don't actually know what I'm going to. I, I like it. he put on his Instagram saying that you know, uh, cop the vinyl, cop a CD, come down to Prism in Kingston today. Actually, I'm going there later. Um, but yeah, um, cop cop it, come down to Prism, and he'll sign it for us um so yeah i yeah that's what i'll be doing later on today hopefully i can get that signed meet the man and um yeah you know just sharing the greatness you already know fam yeah it's it's gonna be a it should be a cool vibe cool cool little occasion going down there so yeah this should be signed by the time i get back yeah and i'll show you that yeah um so yeah, i guess i'll put the my experience uh, um, going to prison, probably here in the video, brief little thing, right here. Ah, okay, yeah, a little show set up there and that. Bro, I had no idea prison was this nice little setup. So this is this is nice. Obviously, waiting on Koji. Just your reason to smile. 
Koji Ranku. Hello, hello, let me put my drink down. Bloody hell. We're gonna get into some music soon. I know normally rappers come out and it's like, dead. <laughs> but I wanted to chat to you for a second, do you know what I'm saying? Listen, Reason to Smile is out now. Uh, it's been a long time coming, but I know everybody in this room is a supporter, you know? To get a ticket today, you had to get a copy of the album and buying that album makes all the difference. Like my goal, I had a vision board. I'll tell you about this vision board later. But on the vision board, I said I wanted a top 10 album. I've had some good news. Well, we're not there yet, but I had some good news. And I want to thank everybody in this room. I want to dedicate this album to everybody in this room. We're going to have fun today. Yeah? Right, what should we start with? Um, nah, not yet. No, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. That one, I'm not gonna lie, we did one in London yesterday. <laughs> it was vibes. So, it's my first time performing in Kingston ever. So, this is the standard setup. So, let's kick it off with something from the new album. Let's kick it off with Pusher, man. Ah, uh, stuck between a rock and a hard place. Stops in my time, please. Don't watch face, this room got elephants in it Tough crowd, long day, can't please everybody Can't trust anybody, this game wasn't ready for me Still got some readies for me, it's cool man, I'm ready for me Pop wasn't steady for me, I walk different Ain't cold switching, I talk when you're frowning And I know that man energy round me Still I wish you the best to an enemy To my so 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 with the jealousy And at least I'm no better without me All I need is a piece of portion Day to day I don't do too much talking Hey, when they take my words and restore them Money waters, I'm stepping with caution Day to day I just don't have a test Next order of business is just slapping this onto the record player and seeing what we've got. So, so I'm gonna do. Follow me over here, bro. Off the first listen, let's see what we got. See what we got, people. Okay. So obviously, I've got a automatic turntable in my room, but um, yeah, you you want a manual one? Yeah, you definitely want a manual one still. But um, yeah. So what do we do next? Come on, you already know, fam. Got pop. What is that, Mumsy? Is that who knows? I don't know. We gotta show the African roots. Reason to smile, I hear that. Tiana Major 9. Bro, this is real lyricism. Like, not all that chef man, quest man down stuff. <laughs> Reason to smile. See, I need a better smile. <laughs> ah, see, man needs to do a rating for this now as well, the whole project, because I thought maybe I would like the maybe i would like the um the singles more but 
Yeah, Koji's yeah. not that kind of so artist. Three, six, There's always gonna be hella gems in it. button because I'm doing I'm doing a lot you know very long I do it because I love it mm. oh, get your shit to, who is this nah Maverick Sabre on this writing boy fam you got Maverick Sabre writing on this as well ah oh, nah this project ah. oh. next track what's this nappy I hear that oh rah I've just seen my man's um my man's actual name here it's Koji's uh, government name I hear that that's a real African name. Man came with Masego. Yeah, the features as well. He's a, he's a good selection of features. 60x in it so that's the the record player if anybody wants that i'll see if i can find the link for for it if it's still if it's still um raw if you can still buy it yeah no bit of a brain fart there but oh yeah i forgot to say come on you gunners but yeah side b <laughs> what we got for them 
What's it? What's the name? What's, what's on the side B? Pressure featuring Shay Universe. Shout out Shay. Miss Universe. We'll stand the pressure. I can't even show you all that, um, you know, all the songs. I don't know. Can, can you guys hear me properly? I'm like, yeah, I'm fully trying to speak over this music. I might have to, hmm. You guys let me know. I might need a mic set up here as well. Yeah, no, nah, so far, this this project is extremely, it's, 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 yeah, it's inspiring to me, like, it's inspirational to men right now, because, yeah, no, nah, just, like, inspirational is just about, like, when you're an artist, or, when, like, anything, anything in life, or anything you're trying to do, it's just about consistency, and just keeping going, and, yeah, just that determination to be able to reach the end goal. It's difficult out here for a number of artists, of course, and yeah, it's just keep going, people. Keep going, people. Ah, bro, what? Born featuring Cash. Yeah, I don't even know what to say to you so far. So far, this every song is hitting. Every song is hitting still. The instrumentation, sound selection, the features so far. Just... Yeah, nah, this, uh, this album's a vibe. This album's a vibe. Bro, we're only five songs in. There's still another ten. Bro. Wow. Reason to smile, bro. Koji smashed it. So, so far, so good. Uh, oh, okay. So what I'm going to do, yeah? The way I'm rating these, these projects right now, I, I deeped it. Okay, I, I definitely need to rethink my my um, my rating for um, Simbi's project. Um, sometimes I might be introvert. I need to listen to that properly and give a proper rating. But I'm gonna go where every project starts on a ten, and I guess we'll would we'll, you know the it's like marking down basically, isn't it? Yeah, I, think, I prefer doing that. I do that sort of thing with anime. Do you know what? I might start banging some anime reviews as well. But yeah. Push a man. Actually, no. No. I'm gonna do something different. I'm gonna say everything starts on a nine out of ten. No. Okay. I got it. Everything starts on an 8 out of 10 And obviously if you exceed my expectations We'll push it up to a 9 or a 10 Because we can't just be giving 10s out there, innit? It doesn't, it doesn't really make sense, does it? But, um, yeah, we'll do that And then obviously mark down if, if it's not really, do you get what I'm saying? So 8 out of 10, I think that's a good little That's a good little starting point for every project, isn't it? Like, and then we'll see if we go up or down from there, in it. Right now, this project's on a nine. I ain't gonna lie to you. Cause I was thinking 10 out of 10, like, can you just give 10? Or do we just break the mold and just start slapping our 10s? I don't know. Right now it's a nine though. Right now it's a nine. I shouldn't be speaking over this right now. Obviously I'm gonna be listening to I was gonna say I 
should be listening to the lyrical content, but I will obviously take in the album more, listen to it more times. This is off the first listen, people. So it is what it is. Nothing more dangerous than a black man with intelligence. Even mm -hmm. that's when he got some relevance. Mm -hmm. Giving drugs to my people and telling them left them fucked. They like you better when you celibate. You ain't a boss if you ain't never got your hands. Celibate. Caught over 15, your honor gave a man 30. They didn't want to see me grow. Think I what this, I just stay the same that I can't keep you close. Real talk. I know too much. Jeez. There's nothing more dangerous than a black man with intelligence. Ah. Especially with some relevance. Bro. Honestly, bro. Yeah, I don't, for me to not say this is 10 out of 10 right now. I don't know. I don't know. Right now, all right, I'm, I'm going to say it's a clean 9.5 right now. Clean 9.5. So far. So far, that's where we at. All right. All right, we're back in. We got side C. Talking featuring Khalees and Tiana Major 9 again. Oh shit, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 I heard this, um, um, this is like the little snippet that you get, um, with the promo on his Instagram. Bro, listening to this project, I feel like I'm learning. So I had to put on my glasses still. You already know, there's a war outside. Literally, right now. It's crazy. There's a war going on outside. Nobody see it but me. And I'm not even, I'm, bro, I'm not even talking about the Ukraine war. Bro, there's a war on madness, bro. Bad shit. A war on security, a war on autonomy. There's a war going on outside. Nobody see it but me. A war on free speech. There's a war going on outside. Nobody see it but me. There's a war in the streets, man, amongst young people. People getting chefed all the time. Young black people dying. Well, young people dying. It's not just black people, but yeah. Peace. It can be so simple, but it's complicated. Wearing black, but yeah. Man like Nux. Alright, next we have Fubu. I think my neighbors think I'm selling drugs, so they show me love, because it probably make them cooler if they think that I'm a dog. I don't know about assumptions, I know this ain't what you want. Black people start and drop. Don't mistake me for no pump selling dreams. Should I drop the album on Black Pound Day? Or will they still support it just because it sounds great? I could pause the track. Instead of speaking over it. Yeah. I, I definitely should have been doing that. But we move. <laughs> Live and learn. Alright, so we are on to the last side of the project. Um, yeah, excuse me while I just flip this real quick. Alright, we've got the last side. Side D. What's the first track? Beautiful featuring Shaka and Wretch Free 2. Look at that. I had to hit her on the phone. I like, wait till I get home. Pour me some Patron enough to get me in my zone. We can make a perfect storm if the weather nice. I can love you on the bonnet because you're never nice. You serve it up, I put it down. I got an appetite. So what we eat is got a feeling you'll be satisfied. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I, can I just have to say. 
the instrumentals have been crisp. I don't... I, I want to give it a 10 out of 10. Is this the first 10 out of 10 on, like, is that what we're just going to do? Just, this is just a standard. Instant classic, that's what it's sounding like right now. I think this might be the 10. And this is where the bar is. It might be. I think, I think it might be that still. Let's see. I can love you on the bonnet because you're never nice. You serve it up like a Man like Shaka. Ah, this. Yeah, it's a very good album, man. Bro, do you know what? Listening on vinyl, it just. Yeah, it's something about it. Wow. I don't know if. I don't know if this is coming through, like sound quality wise through the video but it sounds so nice yeah yeah i'm thinking i'm thinking it's a 10 out of 10 so yeah i think that's what i'm giving it oh vocals from koji i see you that is Koji, right? <laughs> yeah, do you know what? I really like the structure of this project as well. Like, you've got, you've got a lot of the more, you know, I guess, female or women, like, you know, directed more towards women sort of tracks later on in the project. It's, um, it's a nice wind down like you, you're winding down with the project and it kind of it's just, to, to be honest it just sounds like a really nice playthrough all the way through um obviously listening on vinyl you have to do the whole you know manual flipping of the of the lps and all that sort of thing but the sound quality just it's different yeah like listening to on spotify you're gonna have a whole bunch of compression and all that like it's not gonna sound as as nice and crisp on this i, I need to get i need to upgrade my speakers and all that but right now it sounds Really nice, really, really nice. What track is this? Solo featuring Rex Life Raj. Hmm. I don't know who this is. Faraji Wright, okay. I hear that. Solo. He's talking to him. Mm. Yeah, make sure you guys go and follow everybody that's featured on this uh, like album as well, because they're clearly all like really talented as well. If you don't know about Tiana Major Nine, Mad Shea Universe. She's on the way up. I'm sure you're going to be hearing a lot more from her. You already know about Shaka, Rec Free 2. But yeah, I don't know nothing about this Rex, was it? Rex Life Raj. Yeah, I don't know. Is it? Okay. Then I realized. I think my mama was a gangster. Jeez, that is a sick, I like that, that's a sick transition, ah, creativity on point, message on point, reason to smile bro, so this is the last track, Gangsta. I think my mama was a hustler and had to double up from the love when Bro, she was tough with us, I had to I know a lot of people can relate. My mum hustle bro. My mum's a hustler as well, bro. Real gangster. I can't lie, I didn't know what to expect from 
the, the track um, when it's got the title Gangsta, but I should have known. <laughs> I should have known. It's going to be deeper than just gangster talk. You already know. Nah, man. I respect this project highly still. Like, this project has made me. It's just made me realize that, yeah, I, well, I already knew, but. I definitely need to up my, my writing ability, my writing levels, and just, yeah, just put my head down and handle my business, really. Flipping out. I think I know. Ooh. Yeah, I think I know where, where this one's ranking, to be honest. The rating is high. Yeah, this was proper. This this was proper. You're doing very well. I'm so proud of you. What you're doing. D exactly. You're very very well. Very very well. You can't do any more than what you're doing. <laughs> He's gonna do more. <laughs> He's gonna do more. But I hate you, Mumsy. I hate you. Yeah. No. That. Listen. Okay. Okay. Let me let me move back over here and we'll wrap this up. Okay, people. So that was. Koji Radical, Reason to Smile, the vinyl, the album, and yeah, <laughs> bro, I'm going to keep it all the way 100. Oh, oh snap, do you know what, I've just looked at that project, it's his mum, and I believe that's Rachel Ama and their child, I've just deeped, I've just deeped the, the project properly, or the, the album art, the album cover, I mean the album cover. I hear you. I see that. Yeah. Respect. Respect. Bro, this is a 10 out of 10. Like, I was going to say, I was going to, all right. So what I was going to say was it's a 9.5. And in the next episode, when I do another vinyl, I'll, you know, I would have listened to the project a couple more times and I would, um, you know, adjust my rating accordingly. But in my mind, it's going to be a 10, I'm pretty sure. I, I, I know I'm going to listen to this a couple more times and I'm just going to get the same vibe. The same vibe as I did just off the first listen. And it's just, this is an instant classic. Like, I can't even, I can't even knock this. This is, yo, 15 songs, solid, solid out in, like, debut album. It's going to take some doing to top this, in my opinion. It's very good. Very good. Pro I, and to be honest, you know, I, I have faith in Koji Radical. I, I believe he'll be able to top this because, and this is this might be an unpopular opinion. I don't really care, but um, I personally feel like just what I've heard from Koji Radical consistently is just levels above most of the like, in my opinion, levels above most of the rappers that you know are just oversaturating the the uh, soundscape. The, the you know just. The, the scene essentially um there's obviously there's a whole bunch of other artists that are within that same category but Koji Radical is one of them as well and he's just yeah he's just doing his thing like he's just smashing it every single time in my opinion I would probably and this is why I say it's an unpopular opinion I'm you know obviously leave it in the comments below if you agree or not but I just feel like he's like the Kendrick Lamar of the UK really and that's that's crazy high praise from like I love Kendrick Lamar in it so for me to say that I I can't see anybody really in the same vein in it obviously don't get me wrong like, I still like Kendrick Lam Kendrick Lamar is my guy of course and I'm not really trying to compare the two but I see him as the Kendrick Lamar of the UK and that yeah I don't really feel like I'm gonna be able to shake that feeling to be fair so yeah man. I think this is a 10 out of 10. Obviously, you know, I'll listen to him a bit more and we'll see if my opinion of it changes, but I don't really think it will. So, yeah, man. This is the standard. Man Like Koji Radical has set the bar. Solid project, man. I can't even, can't even say anything bad about it, honestly. So that's a 10 out of 10 for me and everything else is going to have to compete with that, to be honest. Um, I guess, yeah, what else, what else can I say for the end of this video? Yeah, if you've liked this video, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification so you see whenever we post, um, there's a whole bunch of other content. Uh, I should be putting out some gaming content soon, uh, new podcast episode coming soon.
I think, yeah, I think that's a good place to end it. Signing off, people. Thank you for listening. And, um, yeah, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.